Deteriorating shell quality is still a big concern in commercial egg producer. Broken and cracked eggshell are responsible for the major economic losses for the egg producers. There are two important roles for the eggshell. Firstly, the shell must provide a better container to the egg's content. And the secondly, the shell must prevent from bacteria penetration. To provide a proper container to the shell, the shell must be strong enough to withstand the, present, the processes of the being laid by the hands, collected, graded, transported to the market, and handled by consumer. And to the consumer, the eggs must be normal, no cracks, no defects. Body weight uniformity is another factor that can influence the overall egg quality. Parkinson et al. have found that flocks studied had an average body weight 100 to 300 grams above the breed standard, which, uh, which indicated as obesity. This obese bird can produce excessively large eggs, which lowered the eggshell quality. So we set up a research with the three different groups of body weight, light, medium, and heavy, to evaluate the eggshell quality. The variables that we measure are egg weight, egg sh uh, shell weight, shell breaking cell, strength, cell deformation, shell effectivity, shell thickness as well as cuticle cover, and we use MST cuticle stain and spectrophotometer. As well as uh, egg production and body weight, we measure from 19 weeks to 80 weeks. And this research, we found body weight group and hand edge group have a significant effect on body weight and cuticle cover. Body weight increase as hand age increase. And egg production, are better in medium body weight groups. But interestingly, we found that cuticle cover and shell breaking strength was higher in the light group. So in conclusion, having the correct body weight at the start of egg production will enable pullets to achieve their potential, genetic potential. Thank you.